Today we're diving back to Gear Street 3 with a guitar I know that you're going to love. I'm not going to spoil the surprise. Hey and welcome back to another video from 42 Gear Street number 3. And today I'm checking out a guitar that I checked out way back in September of 2018 when I went to GitCon number 2 and where I met the lovely Nick Johnson. And what we've got is Nick Johnston's Schecter. And this one is the signature series. It's got locking tuners on the back. It's got a lovely slanted neck joint, which gives you great access. It's a beautiful uh, roasted maple neck with no skunk. So we know that the truss rod is put on underneath this fingerboard. And I love these little circle inlays. I think they're really, really pretty. It is an HSS style, humbucker single single, and it's got a standard five-way switch. It does have a push-pull to split the humbucker, and it's also got a single volume and single tone rather than the three um, knobs on a Fender style guitar. One of the things I really love is the truss rod adjuster in the neck. I really like these because of the ease of access and the fact you don't have to get in between the strings or on a fender, let's face it, you used to have to take the neck off to adjust the truss rod. <laughs> So there we are, it is an orange color. Now I know that is going to be a, uh, a love it or hate it Marmite style guitar. What do you think of the color? Is it a color that you would play? Let's find out what it does play like and then we'll come back and uh, after you've heard the tones, I'll tell you what it was like to play. Thank you. 
okay i really hope you liked the tones that i managed to get out of it and uh, as an average guitar player hopefully it has shown you what an average guitarist will sound like on this instrument it is a really really smooth easy neck i have to say the uh, ends of the frets are very rounded and this whole thing feels like it has been set up really really nicely the action at the 12th fret is about a millimeter and a half just where i like it and it really does play beautifully the trem is not your standard fender trem it's got a push-in trem but i didn't try out the trem because i couldn't find the trem bar to be honest but there we go I think that this guitar was probably the easiest to play and had the most easy to find tones on it uh, of the show for me. I really, really do love the Schecter Nick Johnston guitar and I think that it's just one that you can pick up straight away and get good tones and good playability out of it. So full marks to Schecter for the fit and finish on this. And I think obviously Nick Johnston has put his name to it because they've done such a good job as always i'm really keen to know what you guys think obviously it's a marmite color some people will love the orange some people will hate it but let me know in the comment section down below what you think of the color and also and more importantly what you thought of the tones of this guitar and i really hope it's been useful for you i'll be back with the very best content i can both from gear street number three and obviously tons of other stuff as well just as soon as i can but in the meantime as always my friends you take good care so there we go i'm pretty sure you love that nick johnson check the guitar i really did and i'll be back with more for you in coming live videos i hope you enjoyed it